Hey, what's up everybody? This is the boy JC and yo, check this out. I finally got my package today for the enclosure for the internal SSD hard drive and I got the internal SSD hard drive. Thanks to one of my subscribers, last night he pointed out to me that um, it may not work. You don't think it's going to work for the PS5. I thought it could. So I was a little bit disappointed and I called Amazon to see if I could cancel the order. They said um, it can't do nothing right now. I just have to wait until I to the package will come and refuse it so you know what i just got it i promise you guys i'm gonna make a video even though i'm a little bit disappointed to know that but i'm still gonna do it anyhow because a promise is a promise all right so this is what we got right here i don't know what's inside this but this package so let me open up and see what's inside yeah and i just want to thank you guys for 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 clipping for watching the videos and um, I really appreciate the subscribes. Thank you guys. And um, that's all I can say. Thank you. But anyway, enough talking. Let's see what's inside. So this is a Mokin um, Mokin SSD enclosure. He, um, you got right here 10 gigabytes enclosure for M.2 NVMe, and it's also S a SADA SSD. So it's like a multi multi-purpose multi-purpose thing you can use. So this is right here. So in this package right here, it's the um, most likely it's going to be the the internal hard drive. Excuse me. Yeah, this is it right here. This is the um. Watch my Come on closer. This is the um the PNY one terabyte, the NVMe PCIe. Oh, that's too much. Third gen. All right. Right here it shows right here. Read speed up to 3500 and write speed up to 1800 mega, megabits per second. And this is the, the description in the back right here. So I'm not going to go into all of that drama. So let's go open the package and see what's inside. So this is the enclosure right here. Let's see what comes in the package. This is the, um, oh, it's stubborn. This is the enclosure, nice metal feel. Got it for cheap on Amazon for $16.99. Metal casing, that's cool. USB Type C. And I think this is the slider part right here. Let me see. Yeah. Oops, dang. Where did it go? Ah, oh, here we go. <laughs> I almost lost it. This is the slider right here. And um, I think this is how you um, take it out. There you go, you take it out. And these are the co components that's inside. As you can see, you got the USB Type C adapter right here. It's already in, so it's not separate. Where you have to get a, a, a screwdrivers and whatnot and do your thing. No, they make it very simple. It's simple, which I like. So what else is in the box? You got the USB Type A, the USB Type C. So you know the PlayStation got the USB Type A and in the back and the USB Type C to the front. And now um, this is another cable right here. This is USB Type C. The USB type C for the enclosure. That's pretty cool. And what is inside? Oh, there it is. These are the pegs. Yeah, you need these pegs. What these pegs does you go to the back of the SSD so you could so you can clip it on to one of these holes right here to keep it stable. Cool. So that's all for this right here. I like to keep things nice and nice and um neat because I don't like to lose nothing because everything costs money. Alright. Now for the big boy, this one that um this one that kind of put my pocket in a hole right now, so I like, I, want, I don't want to rip it up too much, cause it's a nice looking box. Cause I'm definitely gonna send it back to Amazon if it doesn't work. There we go, nice and neat. I'm sliding from the side right here, and this is the beauty right here. Do you see it? The PYN. Come up closer so you guys can see it. The PYN M.2 NVMe Solid State Drive NVM Express. Cool, I like that. So let me just go ahead right now and take it out of the casing. Take it out this little thing right here. Dang, I'm so nervous. Whew. I don't want to break nothing. I am very, very cautious. Because if you broke it, you bought it. Alright, there we go. Nice and simple. See? Closer. This is the front. And this is the back of it. Okay. See right here. 
it's kind of nice it, it have a little weight to it if it's good and like i said this is my first time doing something like this i'm very nervous to, to, to be honest with y'all i'm very nervous because i never did something like this before but i'm going to take my very time and give it a try and y'all don't laugh at me man hey at least i'm trying don't laugh at me all right <laughs> and then again like again i want to see you guys thank you guys for tuning in and if you still haven't subscribed yet go ahead and hit the subscribe hit the likes and then leave a comment i really appreciate them all right now back to what we're doing so according to the diagram this is how you should put it in okay so i'm gonna slide it in you can show right here close up oops right here i'm gonna put it right here through the slot right here okay i'm gonna put it in right here like this Okay, nice and oh, it's not in all the way. Hmm, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's not snug. Let me pull it back out again. Like I said, this is my first time doing something like this, you know, very first time. Oh, dang. Okay, it, it's have a little um, learning curve to it. Let me double check for, for my angle right here. Hold on one second, guys. Hold on one second. I think okay. There we go. This thing is very, this is very technical. You got to look a groove. You got to be very careful that it goes right into the groove. I think it's on top right here. And again, I don't want to break nothing. Okay, I think I got it in. This is kind of this is kind of irritating, yo. Okay, hold on, I'll be right back. Now I'm back. After many um trial and trial and error, I got to slide in. But now this is what I'm supposed to do. Put this um peg in the groove. See, come up closer. The peg. So unfortunately, I'm gonna put it up. I got to plug it back out and um get this peg. Put the peg in this little slot right here. Let me show you. Boom. See, just like that. Dang. Yep. Can't wait to get can't wait to get another camera. But I use my iPhone right now. I appreciate iPhones, but I gotta work hard, save my money to get a, to get a real nice camera. Now, here we go. This is the pegs. Now this is the SSD. This is the peg right here. I'm gonna slide it in this groove, just like this. See, it's right there. Just like that. Now, let's go back and plug this bad boy in right here. With many trials and error. Uh huh. It's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of big. And I don't know if this is the right peg, cause the thing not sliding all the way like I want it to. It should be all the way in, so the peg can just snap. Okay, boom. I think I got it. Oh dang, I think I got it. Yeah, see? Oh damn. No, it looks like it's off. Show you right here, guys. And this is the peg. So it fits in the groove. Trying to find a groove right here. It's kind of hard because I can't see from my angle. Hope you guys can see it. Uh-huh. See, I show underneath here. Aha, uh -huh. right there. So I gotta slide it in so it could snap. Gosh, this is more complicated than I thought. But then again, it's my first time doing something like this. So if I break it, I bought it. And it's for your education, it's for me to learn, and it's for your educational purposes only. And for your professionals out there. You can leave a comment and I really appreciate it. See, I finally got it in. Never give up. Never give up. <laughs> all right. Anyway, so it's all the way in. You go see right here. It's all the way in, flushed in. Nothing is broken. Thank God. The peg holds it right in place. All right, good. Now, let's get the casing. Put the casing on. Just like this. All right. And, um... Where did I put that thing? Okay, there it is. This is what you need to close it, right here at the back. So you're gonna put it in like this. I believe. Oh, dang. I'm clumsy, y'all. <laughs> oh, God, but this is fun. I like doing things for the first time, not knowing what I'm getting into. I like to just jump right into things. I like to learn, I like to learn on the fly. I don't know if any of y'all is like that, but that's me, I like to learn on the fly. But anyway, enough talking. Let's, let's see what we can do here. And it's right in. Perfect. Now, 
No, here's a, here's a, here's a part. I'm going to take it to my room. I'm going to plug it into my PlayStation 5 and see what happens, all right? So, like I said, they say that it may not work because it's a Gen 3. And um, the PlayStation 5 uses a Gen 4. So, it's all right. I spend my money. Amazon, Amazon will give me a refund. But I'm doing this for, for, for my for my use and for your um for your entertainment and educational purposes because like again i never did something like this before this is my first time doing something like this so i'm pretty excited so here we go i'm going to switch to my playstation 5 and give it a test <laughs> 